You are most welcome to Governor Council Chamber. We were having our management meeting in the early morning and we were expecting to meet you at 11. As customer demands, we are set for work and we have started working. You want to know your purpose of meeting Vice Chancellor and his management. And since we have the Amalgamated Sports Club chairman, I will direct my request of the purpose of your visit to him. Thank you. Good morning. Good morning, sir. Vice Chancellor, we are very happy to be here um, to present to you a report on activities that we undertook in December and in January. We, we selected and invited 270 students and 40 officials to come in preparation towards the 26 visa games that was held at the University of Ghana, Labour. This campaign started on the 20th of December and ended on the uh, 2nd of January 2020. Throughout the campaign, there wasn't any incident. Um, medical issues were dealt with by the medical team, um, welfare, feeding, transportation, accommodation, everything was in order. So we prepared and we were hopeful that when we go to Lagos, we are going to make an impact. And that is exactly what we did. We left Minima on the 10th of January to Lagos. Uh, that evening, all the students were checked into their various rooms. Uh, we made sure that they were properly cared for their meals, their transportation to the various venues, um, their welfare, were all catered for. So on the, on, the, on the fifth, when the competition started, we knew definitely we were going to do well. But the day after that was when the opening ceremony came on. And we're glad to have the pro vice chancellor to be part of the opening ceremony. And I will invite my colleagues here to give him a clap for the tremendous support. <laughs> so we started. In fact, initially it was difficult. We knew our opponents were having materials that are of very high national standards. But we're also confident in the fact that we have prepared our athletes for the competition. So we were beating people here and there, and they were also beating us. <laughs> but the bottom line is that at the end of it all, at the end of it all, we, we made a very strong statement. And the statement is that you can no longer take UW for granted when it comes to USA games. Somewhere during the competition, during the athletics especially, there were a number of records that were broken. And by just like, you see, sometimes when you start something, people don't see it until the results are showing. Why just like a management gave us the opportunity to go out and scout for athletes to represent you in various games. And if you look at the records that were broken, they were broken by people who came in on the scholarship team. So basically, we, we have come here to show you what we have done with the support that you gave us. And we are happy to note that out of the six records that were broken in the athletics, five of them came from first years. What it means is that 
we have the potential of even increasing the distance and the time that we made. Because these are young men and women who are growing up. And definitely, when they get another chance, they will take UEW to places. So, even though we went with the sole aim of becoming the first university in the game, we played second. And from our past experiences, <laughs> looking at the, the number of gold medals that were won by the previous second position and the, the, uh, the number of goals that we took for the second position, there is a tremendous improvement in our performance. So, VC and members of the investing management, we are here to present to you um, these sportsmen and women with the officials who won gold medals representing the entire contingent to tell management that we are most grateful to to management for the support that was extended to amalgamated sports. In fact, when I met my colleagues at the games and they heard that our vice chancellor, our registrar, and the pro vice chancellor visited us, they were surprised. And somebody reported that even though our university is just across the street, we don't see our people here. But our, our um, management team came to give us support. And not that only, they also motivated us in other, other ways. Promise you, can I say that one? <laughs> <laughs> don't say everything. Yes. <laughs> the registrar, the ProBC, the, uh, the BC came and gave us an amount to have an evening get together, which we, we are still remembering what we did. In fact, that evening was a very enjoyable uh, evening. <laughs> So Vice Chancellor, we are very, very grateful to you and your team for the, the, the motivation that you have given to us. Um, I, I know definitely when you go to VCG meeting, they are going to repeat that because they, our police promise that when they go back, they are going to tell their Vice Chancellors to visit them when there is competition. <laughs> definitely, you, you will do that. <coughs> Now, Vice Chancellor, just to um, hammer on a few things, a few achievements. We have here a handball team, a, a female handball team that had won Busa for the past 10 years. Yeah. And we also have, especially in this chamber now, record breaking athletes. Uh, if I may start, this young man but broke two records oh, in 800 meters and 500 meters. The gentleman next to him also took gold in this cast man. Boy. <laughs> <laughs> if, if you see this man running, he's like a, a horse. He doesn't get tired. And he also broke two records. The 5,000 men and 10,000 men. Sometimes, when people see your potential, they want to take you at all costs. Even today, as I'm talking to you, there are universities that are trying to slash him, but we will not let him. <laughs> oh, but his, his uh, un uh, uncle was the uh, guardian, Professor Yanka. Yes, please. Has made it known to us that this way he stayed in after his. Oh, uh, yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so, Richard, Richard, we are not letting him go. Thank you. <laughs> and we have here for Steve, who also to gold and broke record in this class women. And we have
had a four, a four by 400 meters men who also broke a record. So now they are the record holders. We have Nenyi here. He is the captain of the team. Unfortunately, the rest are not around. Yes, there is a competition that is going on that they are participating. So, what is that? We, UW is an inclusive university. So, whenever we are having any program, we don't leave behind people with um, impairments or disabilities. And to show that really we are an inclusive university, we took the Go Ball team and the men won Go. Coordinator, 
Dr. Kojo Yuichi, and the medical officer, Dr. Ajari. And finance officer's uh, representative on Abagamite Sports Committee, Mr. Eric Abaka. And last but not the least, Mr. Pufa Jr. Uh, he is the coach for athletics, specifically for the jumps. So high jump, full boots, um, triple jump, and then long jump. Is there somebody there? Yes, the one who prepared nice meals for me. <laughs> <laughs> see, if we didn't encounter anything, if, I, if you remember, when we went to Tamale, the what you learned of the issues that we had was from the kitchen. But this time, we didn't have any difficulty with meals. Seven of meals, the quantity, the quality, and on timing, it was OK. So we are also grateful to uh, Ms. Uh, uh, Mrs. Uh, Tamaklu Hartwell for the work that he did. In fact, I think at the appropriate time, during the dinner, all the rest will be recognized. And then comes the tennis players, and then the table tennis. We want to thank management. I want to urge management to continually give us the support. In fact, sports is something, uh, one activity that can take you of you to places. Now we have the the feet, we have the hands locally that are very good. And if management will consider and let us participate in international competitions, then definitely the name of UW or two sports. The internationalization agenda of the vice chancellor can be realized. So, we see, we have come to report that you sent us to the University of Ghana for Musa Games. We are back with these trophies and medal winning athletes as evidence of our participation. And we will leave the trophies in your offices. And later come for them. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. After the trophies are for kids, so they will be perfect. Thank you very much. Uh, the promise you will say a few words and then you'll be the rest of Thank you very much, uh, Vice Chancellor. And let me take this opportunity to welcome all of you again to the room. Uh, and that's a few ways to that. First, we are very excited to have you here. Um, even though we have savored the victory time ago, we've come to refresh us with the same level of excitement that we had during the time. So we are excited to have you here. And we are proud of you all. Uh, management as a team and individually everybody in the management team and, and faculty and senior members everybody is proud of you uh, for the wonderful performance that you put up we followed up from day one now day by day report came from general batuka and his team and every day uh, the vice chancellor uh, some of us will be exchanging WhatsApp messages on the performances. And so uh, we are so proud of you as a team. Uh, we can't hide our pride. And when you entered in your beautiful t shirt, uh, it even uh, made us more excited and refreshed the joy that we had during that time. Uh, from the onset, it was clear that your team had had the support of management. And let me indicate to you that when the VC was leaving, uh, for uh, the state, he indicated to me that I have to be on standby uh, so that should anything arise that they need the support of management, I'll be there. And 
because of that, I also I was on tap by, and I kept communicating with the team through the welfare team and, and then the chairman. And I'm, I'm happy to say that from the beginning up to the end, we saw probably it was the first time that I was following Gusa again closely. But I saw some level of compatibility among officials and a high level of comportment and discipline among athletes. At least on the two times that we visited you, we never had any report of somebody misbehaving or divisions among officials. And those are things that were location uh, uh, gains and, 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 and troubles among officials and athletes. But we never had any report like that. So that's a, a, a big cup a feather in the cup. Thank you so much. Um, let me also indicate that for us, you were first, not second. If you look at the fact that you rose from the field position that we we were placed to a second position, you know, you know when you are going for a match and you are playing with top teams, you say, okay, it did right like that, it did right. Like I remember I watched a match between Liverpool and I think the the, the Africa, and then the match ended in the draw. And then the other team, uh, which was the second first division, they were celebrating, jumping, popping champagne. To them, they had won the match. <laughs> Even though it was just a draw. And so for us, we have won. We are in the first position because you did more than what we were expecting. So in our half, we have won. And we are also proud of our record breakers. So, so, so proud of you. Now, sometimes when you are going for all that you look for is to win the goal. You never think about breaking record. So when the record breaking started coming in, then we tell ourselves, well, this is enough. Now, now we don't care anymore about what position. We can talk about record, you know, because those are the ones that are archived forever. So the record breakers, we are part of you. And VC has, indi has indicated so many times that all activities in this university none of them will be marginalized. And there's no way uh, an activity or activities like sports will be put on the sideline. Once again, welcome to the council room, boardroom. We are proud of you and we are excited and management will continue to give you all the support that you need in order to meet the internationalization agenda. Thank you very much. So, uh, all the nice things that the VOTC said, I told him to say that. <laughs> <laughs> so we are very proud of you. I don't need to repeat anything. We should have, as a, as a mark of our sincere appreciation, a get-together. We should have a party. Normally, it takes place at the end of the semester, but we wanted it to be earlier. Uh, we defer to you. I have already checked with the finance officer, and the, the money for that is ready. I, I had already instructed him on getting the money on standby. He says, even if we want to have the party tomorrow, the money is ready. So, uh, I would like you to uh, have the necessary um, interactions and, and, and come to an agreement on what day will be suitable to you. Of course, checking with our schedule and availability as well. Um, we are committed to ensuring that every student here and every staff here gets the necessary support. We were strategic. It wasn't just something that happened by chance. Your chairman has done a lot of very good work. I remember having some back and forth with him. At some point, I thought that he was being too ambitious, and at some point, I thought that he was making too many demands on us because my, my vision of ensuring that um, there is a lot of infrastructure in the university, because these are some of the things that you can always remember people by, uh, was going to cause me having to neglect a few important things. But having been a provisi myself and knowing that uh, sports is one of the compulsory things that are supposed to be held and not relegated, I've had to even um, reprimand some lecturers who ignored the mandatory period of sports. 
Uh, and so it shows that we value it. Our eyes and our minds are with you. We've been following the activities. Uh, I think that if it is possible to make some sacrifices to even enlarge the budgetary allocation for sports, we'll be committed to doing that. Pray that, uh, pray that your, your colleague students will pay their fees because that's, that's our major source of income to enable us to go out and out there. We want to adopt snowballing. In other words, if you knew of someone somewhere who is good in something, don't hesitate to let the chairman and his team know about it so that wherever they are, we go and bring them. As for Puche, I, I, I'm not worried about that. I don't, I don't envisage anybody allowing themselves to be pushed into another university. Uh, if you have chosen to come here, I hope you know already that there is no university offering the kind of things that we offer here. We may not have been established 60 years ago like others. We are only 25 years old, but those that started ahead of us are very envious of us. If you don't know, you can check at the top, NCTE, NAB, BCG. They have very, very high regard for the kinds of things we do in this university. Um, we will continue to support you. We will continue to keep you here comfortably. If anybody is trying to push you, they should be careful. They are members, they are at least don't run to us. <laughs> Especially when there has been such negative media publicity about this university, and now the truth is coming out in a very consistent manner. It is only fair, it is only logical that everybody will be flocking to this place, the place of peace and progress and prosperity. This is a place where we are interested in the stakeholders, the major stakeholders, which is the students. Um, ProVC has made many powerful statements, one of which I'd like to come on. The collaboration and the team building that took place among your leadership is one thing that we want to commend and not take for granted. We thank you very much. So let us know when the party is, and then um, what day you want, and then we we'll organize a very unique one. We want it to be like none other before. And, and then uh, if there are other suggestions you have, we'll be more than happy to take them. But before you disperse, we'll quickly take a, a stroll down to the frontage of the administration building and have a, a series of group pictures with our trophies, of course. Uh, after the large group picture, I would like to take pictures of the, with the ladies, only the ladies, the ladies, the ladies who had the gold, I'll take pictures with you. And then, the, and then the spider among you. <laughs> Is it a monster? I call him the spider. <laughs> he is so fast. Thank you very much. Thank you. Okay, so we'll go. Don't forget to carry the trophies.